All right, Al, thanks. You know, it's been months since the closing of Central Library downtown. Now we're getting an inside look at the renovation progress. New at 6, 2 News reporter Patricia Santos joins us live in the newsroom with a sneak peek inside. Patty? Well, from the outside, it doesn't look like much has changed, but inside, the building is completely stripped. And it's only the beginning of this nearly $50 million project. I'm just driving by. My, yeah, I do. I do wonder. I'm, I'm trying to look in there, peek. Today, Tulsa City County Library leaders are giving us all a sneak peek. It's much, it's well loved, uh, well used, and a little well worn. So it was uh, time for a makeover. Library CEO Gary Schaefer walks us through the skeleton of the building. Lots of progress is happening in preparation for the construction project to start, um, hopefully in July of this. in the spring of 2016, it's going to look a lot like the librarium. The blank canvas that we are um, presently in uh, will obviously contain books. Um, it will not have as many because it's also going to have an a lot of electronic resources. I like this open area, like, like it here. Aurora Marr at the librarium is looking forward to a 21st century library for her two kids. Because I do some homeschooling, so this is an, another reason why we come here more often. These renderings show us how much more the new library will offer, including more study space, the latest in technology, and even a children's garden. The Central Library has always been the most visited location, and we're anticipating those numbers almost double. 50% of the $50 million project has been paid for by tax dollars. Staff still in the process of fundraising through private funds. Live in the Patricia Santos, 2 News, works for you.